Previously on Soft Valkyrie. On the run, Sigmund finds shelter in Sieglinde's home. The two are unaware that they are siblings, but immediately sense a deep emotional connection. Sparks start to fly. But there is a problem. Sieglinde is married to the cruel Hunding, who now arrives home. Hunding, armed with shield and spear, enters and pauses at the threshold on perceiving Siegmund. Hunding turns to Sieglinde with a look of stern inquiry. Sieglinde answers Hunding's look. Faint, this man lay on our hearth. Need drove him to us. Host and did him. A draft I gave to him, welcomed him as guest. Rest and drink of a she was there for child a woman. Siegmund says firmly, quietly watching Hunding. Sacred is my heart. Sacred although my house. Hunding takes off his armor and gives it to Sieglinde. Send the bill for us now! Sieglinde hangs the arms on the branches of the ash tree, fetches food and drink from the storeroom, and prepares supper. Involuntarily, she again turns her gaze on Siegmund. Hunding looks keenly and with surprise at Siegmund's features, which he compares with Sieglinde's. How like to the woman, the serpent's deceit glistens to in his glances. He hides his surprise and turns unconcernedly to Siegmund. For I draw, let thee thy way. No horse he rode who here found rest, but rank bed have very tight feet. And forest meadow and moor, storm has pursued and sore as need. I know not the way I have come, whither it led me, also oh, I know not. Fain would I learn it from thee. The roof and room that shelter thee, hunting course is all. Hunting offers Siegmund a seat at the table. When the two hands to thy best, thy way in home stands reach. Find this dull kinsman who got the whole note of hunting. Guest, now grant me a grace and thy name make known in return. Siegmund, who has taken his place at the table, gazes thoughtfully before him. Sieglinde has placed herself next to Hunding, opposite to Siegmund, on whom she fastens her eyes with visible sympathy and intentness.
Hunding watches them both. Fearest thou to give me thy trust, to divide here, tell thy secret, see her longing in her look. Guest, who thou art, I would know. Siegmund looks up, gazes into her eyes, and begins gravely. Friedman, may I not call me? From what would that I wear? But where was? So must I name me? Wolfman, I called my father. Alone was I not born. For a sister was twinned with me. Soon lost were both mother and maid. Her who me bore, her who with me was born. Scarce had I ever beheld. Tired from the chase, we came back to our home. There lay the wolf's nest waste. To ashes burned our goodly abode. To dust the oak tree's branch and stem struck dead. Was the mother's virus form and lost in the ruins the sister's trace? The maiden's crossed had dealt this deadly blow. Fled my father to me. Many years I happily lived on with my wolf lord in the wild. Oft beset were we by our foes, but battling with the wolf pair still. A wolf thing tells you this tale. Whom as wolfing many well. and monstrous stories tell us to daring cast Vapor the wolfing methinks of a body or pan I heard dark rumors spoken No, I don't hold nor fell thing you know. Yet further tell us stranger where roams thy father now? The fiery onset on us Then did the maidens begin But slain by the wolves fell many a hunter In flight to the woods Chased by the game Thy chaff was scattered the foes But torn from my father was I This trace I saw not Long was my seeking in the woods of wolf skin. Found I alone, there empty it lay. My father found I not. <laughs> From the woods, dream.
given of love. My heart's longed for men and for women. Amongst all fools. Trusted, he'll faintly on me. Whatever I think I wrought, others counted as ill. What seemed evil to me, others granted as good. In fields I fell, wherever I dwell, wrath met me. He turns his eyes to Zieglinda and notes her sympathetic look. For my help, the kinsmen sought luck to bind in wedlock on love. The man and maid help against wrong. Gladly I gave her ruthless clan. Met me in fight before me, four men fell, struck down. Surged like a storm, full of fury, vengeance devout on me. Every new foam and rose to assail me. But from the place near moved the maid. My shield and spear sheltered her long. Till spear and shield were hewn for my hand. Lifelessly, she on 
the dead. Siegmund faces Sieglinde with a look of sorrowful fervor. Now know thou question in why. It is not free, man. Who greets thee? He stands up and walks to the hearth. Zieglinda looks on the ground, pale and deeply moved. Hunding rises. Hunding seems to know more about Sigmund than he's letting on. What could he know that we don't? If you'd like to find out, you'll have to tune in again next week to Soft Valkyrie, coming June 17th. <laughs>